Hello viewers, I'm Valentin from Gym Trading Bulgaria and today I'm going to share with you another one of my free trading plans. The security in question is the nature of gas. For those of you who are following our YouTube channel for a while, they know that I'm trading this uh, security uh, very often and uh, most of the time it's uh, bringing us a very nice profit. So for now, as you can see that uh, the, pro the chart time frame is on uh, daily and I'm going to, sh to start my analysis by marking our uh, action zone. Uh, this plan that I'm going to share with you today is uh, going to be again with uh, uh, two-way uh, scenarios, one on the short side and one on the long side. So basically, uh, first what I wanted to show you here that uh, this is uh, the area that uh, we're going to uh, observe very closely. As you can see uh, in the last uh, maybe uh, year and a half, the price has reacted from this area uh, very often. For example, here as you can see uh, it acted like a resistance level. Here, as you can see, it acted like a support level. Um, the other thing that I wanted to show you is uh, that uh, the price very often also uh, tried to break this uh, level, but uh, did not succeed very often, which is uh, making it a very, very strong uh, uh, resistance level, as you can see here and uh, here as well. So we have to be careful and we have to be uh, watching for a false break, which uh, might uh, bring us some uh, losses and it might uh, disturb our plan. So the idea here is that uh, we're going to look for a uh, movement uh, very similar to this one that I'm, uh, that I'm showing to you uh, now. Because the idea is uh, here is that uh, we're going to wait for the price to break uh, the levels here and uh, to see that uh, the break is confirmed and it is not going to be a false break like uh, what it did here and uh, after this we're going to open a long position and uh, hopefully we're going to extract uh, very good money from the wave on the long side but uh, first we have to discuss several things uh, the first thing is that uh, if uh, the price started to uh, rise this is a very extended movement on the long side so we have to be very careful and very quick uh, for whenever we want to collect our profit as you can see after it uh, reaches uh, this area here the drop after this in the beginning uh, of the year was huge and uh, also as you can see here for example uh, as soon as uh, the price started to rise again and uh, reaches uh, these uh, uh, areas uh, here as you can see after this uh, movement on the long side it stops on the uh, bottom of this uh, range that I already marked for in this uh, blue rectangle and then it uh, drops again which have to give us uh, the idea that uh, probably we might observe and uh, movement on the short side as well so this is why the scenario will be uh, both ways so basically here my idea is that uh, as soon as i uh, see the outcome of this uh, consolidation that i'm going to mark for you now as well in order to see it more properly uh, after this i'm going to look for a, pro a proper confirmation if the price for example break this uh, area and uh, maybe let's say that it consolidate above the blue rectangle here and as soon as we see that uh, the break is uh, confirmed Probably we're going to uh, wait for something like uh, extended movement like uh, what I did in the, in the end of the last year. I'm going to mark it for you now. So this is uh, what's going to be our uh, very optimistic and uh, main target. Uh, let me just uh, change the color of this in order to see that uh, this is a profit taking area. So as soon as the price reaches this level for sure we're going to close uh, uh, the, whole, the whole position. But, uh, we will see very closely what's going to be the development of the price and what's going to be the performance of the trade and uh, as soon as we see that the buying pressure is exhausted if uh, this plan came uh, into into action we're going to close uh, maybe uh, a little bit early the position our main goal here is uh, to collect uh, some profit and to minimize the eventual losses uh, the other way that uh, we can observe and that uh, actually the other plan we are, is uh, again on the short side uh, it's, uh, it includes again uh, this uh, consolidation here as soon as we see what's going to be the outcome the price might uh, break it on the short side and uh, if that happens uh, probably I'm going to wait and see if the price is going to reach again this uh, support level uh, here I'm going to mark it for you now so basically as you can see the price stops uh, several times uh, here I'm going to change the color So 
Uh, if the price reaches this level here, again, we are going to close the whole position and uh, we are not going to wait for further development of uh, this trade because uh, if uh, the price reaches uh, under this level, this is uh, too oversold. So this is very unlikely to happen and uh, we are not going to look for profit uh, uh, below this area because uh, the correction might appear very quickly and uh, this could uh, reduce our profit. So uh, as soon as the price is on these levels, we are going to uh, close 100% of the position. Uh, maybe a level that uh, we also can observe here on the short side because for now the, the buying pressure is uh, uh, stronger and uh, to my eye probably the scenario on the long side is uh, more, more probable. Uh, so the other level that we might observe is uh, this uh, support level here that I'm going to mark for you now. So as you can see uh, the price uh, as soon as it uh, breaks it, it uh, started to test the rounding number around the level of 3.00 but uh, uh, in the beginning it didn't uh, succeed to uh, break it so uh, after this it uh, fails as you can see it stops on this support level it try it tries to make another test and then on the second uh, on the second wave down it break this uh, support uh, level here and uh, the downtrend continues uh, the situation here is uh, quite similar as you can see the price reaches uh, this uh, uh, level again and after it uh, fails to, uh, break, uh, to break the resistance, it uh, fails back down. Here again, after the drop, there is a test of the, this uh, support level. It uh, fails to uh, stay above it and then the downtrend continues and reaches uh, the levels here. So probably this is uh, what we're going to look for now. If the price uh, started to uh, fail back down again and uh, breaks the support level around uh, 3.00, after we see a strong signal, we are going to try to open a short position immediately. And after this, uh, on this level here, we are going to uh, observe the price uh, very closely and to see if uh, the selling pressure is exhausted. We might lock some profit here or even might, we might hold the whole position. On if, or if we see that uh, the selling pressure is uh, strong and it will break this uh, support level uh, very easily, we are going to hold it until the area here. And uh, then we are going to collect our profit. And uh, basically, this is all about uh, this uh, trading plan. I hope you like it and I hope uh, we're going to be able to extract uh, very good uh, money from, uh, from it. As soon as there is a development on uh, some of the plans, no matter if uh, on, the on the long side or the short side, uh, live signals will uh, follow uh, my actions. And if you want to see uh, how I'm going to uh, manage my trade, then when I'm going to open my position and when I'm going to collect my profit, you can follow us in our uh, official Twitter account and our Telegram channel because our live signals are appearing there. Also, if you like this video and want to see more of our trading plans and the other free videos that we are posting, you can follow our YouTube channel. All the videos that we are posting are appearing there. And of course, uh, all of our other materials are available throughout, uh, throughout our Facebook page. So you can uh, check this one as well. And if you like it, you can subscribe to it. Thank you very much for your attention. I wish everybody luck with this trade as soon as we open a position and I'll see you again next time. Bye bye.